So I wanted to make some sort of thing to pluck the strings of a guitar made for people who either don't have an arm or can't really use their arm. A few days ago I went and broke my arm, so I can't play guitar for several months. So I'm thinking have some sort of motor to just swing around something and pluck the strings and have it attached to a foot pedal so you control it with your feet. I also had an idea to have six different little solenoids that would pluck the strings individually so I can get faster. I could also try attaching picks to a motor and moving that motor across the strings. First I'm going to need to make some sort of rig to hold the motor and the pick in place and then I'll need to try and work out how to control it. This is a wah pedal for playing guitar but we were thinking we could hook up something similar to it so that when I press it down it'll move the pick in one direction and when I lift my foot up it'll move it back. The first thing I did was try and work out which picks to use. The way I worked out which picks were the best was I attached them to a drill and held them up against the strings to pluck them. So it's a steel tube pipe thing two of them with three holes so that you can adjust and there's bolts holding them together and then just some foam in between that to stop it from scratching the guitar. This is the wah pedal that we were going to use to move a motor back and forth across the strings. When you move it, a little thing like that will turn that knob and that's turning something inside here which is like a resistor. So when it's like this, it's not letting through any power at all, but when you put it like that, it's letting through as much power as it can. So I've just come up with an idea of how to make the, the motor move up and down along strings like this. So I was going to use a stepper motor to move something like this with the motor that is spinning the picks on the end of it. So we were working out if we had the motor over here and the string would move over here, how many degrees would be in between each string. So at the moment we're working out how far to get the stepper motor to move. We're doing that by getting the wire pedal into an Arduino and telling it what percentage you're pressing down on. And if it's anywhere between 1 and 20, we'll have the stepper motor. Go to the first string, if it's between 20 and 40, it'll go to the second string, and it'll keep on doing things like that. Mounted the servo motor to the frame, and put just a piece of wood which we're going to mount the picking motor onto. And we've connected it to an Arduino and a wire pedal, so that you can move this around. And then there'll be spinning picks on the end of it. I've just gone and attached the motor to the end of this and shortened it down to get rid of some weight and we're just about to see if the spinning pick will work. The spinning pick will not work! <laughs> I got everything mounted and working but the only problem was it would get stuck on the lower strings. So we got a counterweight that was the same weight as this and put it over here so that the centre of balance was closer to here. We also got a bolt in there to help prop something up. We worked out that the motor has some sort of electrical field, so when the motor's spinning you can hear it through the guitar amp. We've just tried one of the other ideas, which was have just a pick on a stick and have it so that it has six different spots to move to along the strings and it's just constantly moving back and forth. The new method of picking worked very well. Then I tried two different methods of strumming chords. Um, we've put a pick on the end of this piece of wood and just set it so that it's able to strum a chord. So today I've gotten a solenoid with six picks. Each one will hit one string and when I press this button the solenoid will extend. At the moment I haven't propped it up properly. The only problem was you were able to hear the solenoid through the amp, just like the motor. The best method of playing was the pick on a stick idea. In conclusion, I think I did a very good job of making something to play guitar with one hand.